the Taurus. How are you guys doing? It's your mid-May to June reading of this current year. Congrats, you survived so far. Proud of y'all. Troopers, man. Oh yeah, welcome to Taurus season. <laughs> I know I'm late, right? But, it's not always a bad thing. I need to remember to call my sister tomorrow, because tomorrow's her birthday. But, anyway, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If this resonates with you, cool beans. If not, don't worry about it. It's not that big a deal. If you want a personal reading, my email is down below. If you want to donate something, PayPal is also down below. Both in the description box. Happy to make your acquaintance. Anyway, it's going to be six ways to Sunday, Taurus, so I can go back to being lazy, because I'm really good at that. Very much the procrastinator. Although I am trying to get into indulgence right now, which isn't so bad. Oop. Okay. Let's start, Taurus. Six of Swords, looking to leave. You're ready to take off. Someone might be trying to pull you back, though. But what you're wanting and wishing for is not to have to wait anymore to close details and contracts. Your fears is a King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries type. Most likely Leo, though, or someone with Leo in their chart. Then we got the Seven of Swords right here in the situation. Someone might be lugging some shit behind them. Ace of Cups and your challenges and obstacles coming against you. The sun in the catalyst as well as the final result. Your happiness. Or also the Leo, actually. Yeah, this definitely could be a Leo. Um, Prince of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio type. Someone who is not offering their hand up to the cup, but trying to knock it over like a kitty would. So I like to picture it just doing asshole things, because they can't. Because you think that kitty cat cause it might be a Leo. Just putting that out there. Um, this person. How weird, because this isn't entirely bad like someone definitely isn't waiting for love but that's the obstacle or someone doesn't want to wait for love uh now who might be one to leave so probably an idiot as i like to say with the page of pentacles when it's reversed don't shut yourself off thank you yes warm right back up <laughs> i got the heater on i'm so cold natured anymore but yeah, um, Page of Pentacles reversed, right? With the Six of Swords. Like, someone's wanting to leave, they just aren't really accomplishing that. They're not really, um, putting a lot of effort in. They aren't putting any thought into it. They're just kind of whip up. Whatever it is. Could be you, Taurus. Um, could also be someone younger than you. Someone who's not very, uh, Adapt at doing this sort of thing, right? Now we got the Seven of Swords. It talks about sneaky nature. And you got the Six of Swords right above it. So it's like... You're thinking of trying to get away, but you're thinking of possibly going about a sneaky route with it. Coming out of some illusions with that. Some secrets are coming out. Like, is someone sneaking around carrying snakes behind them? Luggage is full of just fucking snakes everywhere and, you know, starting to become suspect. Someone's no longer the puppet on the strings to the moon and the moon rules emotions. So someone's not getting their emotions played with anymore. And things are coming out about what someone's doing behind the back. No. Oh. Hmm. Three of wands reverse. Someone is no longer waiting to have a good time at this point. You know? Someone's going out and they're going to have a good time. They're not waiting for anything right here. That's two threes, too. Hmm. I don't know what two threes mean, but go with it. Then we got the Ace of Cups. So 
Someone doesn't want to wait to have a good time. Is this your whole indulgence side coming out? Like, is someone, like, dampering on your good parade? Is there a reason? Well, stay focused. Like, is there a reason why you feel as though you, um... Wanna, like, you wanna get all your stuff done so that, like, you can enjoy yourself a little bit. But down below, there's this aspect of not really having, like... Ace of Cups, Three of Pentacles reverse. that's another three. Like, something didn't work out when it came work-wise, or some love just fell out when it came to, like, trying to work together. Like, everything, like, everyone did a different style of creativity that just didn't mix correctly, which resulted in, like, maybe the major cup, which was love, being spilled in this. Like, someone lost their love within all of this but at the same time it's just yeah that makes sense like you're you're tired of possibly working on shit and you're just it, it, you feel like possibly it's not coming together and all you want to do is be done with this so you can have a good time that sounds like you torts <laughs> I feel like someone's trying, really trying to escape something, but they're just, they have no idea how to escape. Which is strange, because Taurus, like, you all are the most amazing fucking stalkers I have ever known. Like, it's for real. My little sister's a Taurus. She's an investigator I've never seen. Like, many a time, I think she's taken me on one of her stalking adventures. And it's just like, and like, you guys don't meet, you guys aren't doing it in a malicious way. You just want to know what you want to know. You know, he's, ooh, he has a nice house. Da, 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 da. Like, you know, this is his phone number. This is some of his other information. Like, just, like, you guys are better, like, Scorpios are good at investigating, but y'all are good at, like, knowing people's personal shit. And it's like, mm, Like, you just investigate really harshly. Okay. King Wands right here in the fears and rejections. Not getting the message. You're worried he's not going to get the message. You're worried that even if he gets the message, he's not going to do anything with it. You're afraid he'll just let it pass. Like, he's, like, the one in charge. Which is, like, weird, but okay. But it's like, he's the one in charge. And you're afraid he's not going to deliver something? We got the sun right here, the catalyst, as well as the final result. Um, someone finally getting to let their guard down when, and be happy. That's all you what got, Taurus. And those dealing with Taurus? Wow, this is not a bad reading at all. I was expecting way worse than this. But no, not at all for you, Taurus. It's like, eh. Oh. Someone's mad that their cups got spilled over. And that's why they're kind of not offering love. What the fuck? Like, someone brought a rose and that still wasn't enough. Because they knocked over the cups. And now someone's all pissed about it. So now that love's getting offered. Everyone's cuffs knocked over. I feel like... Okay, so just hear me out here, Taurus. I'm not trying to, um... It feel Okay, it feels like... It's almost like you almost want to, like, break it off with somebody, but you want to make it seem like it's not your fault, so you just start an argument with them, and you argue with them to a point where they get mad enough at you, so they break it off with you, almost? That's what this sneakiness and all that... Like, but I, I don't know if that's you being sneaky or somebody else being sneaky, but someone definitely wants to sneak away. It's just like, it, it, it's like, you're too worried about this person, like, getting the message. Like, everybody else is over here having a good time. They're just standing over there with their freaking sides, waiting to chop some sticks. Like, is it okay for me to come over here? 
Yeah, you're you're done with all of this waiting right here. Like you just want it done and over with, sever ties. Sick of the moon telling you how much you like it. Um, you want like some new passionate, uh, like not really passionate, more like you're kind of being impulsive with where the love's gonna go though. Or this person could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, you might have just shut the door in their face <laughs> just to get the message out because like that cup, like the cup that they offer is one where it's like. Maybe they were, maybe they were just a tad coddled so like their level of emotional happiness isn't as stimulating as um, yours would be. Like maybe it takes a lot more for them to get happy because they get bored easily. Could be this fire sign. Um, but like for them there isn't a lot of satisfaction to put more energy in, I think. Like they, they give whatever they can, which is like on a very low, low level, and that's just not enough, you know? But that's what I got for you for the rest of May to the 1st of April, Taurus. Um, hope you figured this all out. Hope this gives you an idea of what you're going to be looking at. And thank you for watching my video. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.